I'm jumping up the middle. Double up, Cap. Hooked up. Double header. That's how you do it. Jimmy, what's up, man? How you doing? Where's the crew? Is nobody here today? It's just me and you? What's up, man? I've had the privilege and honor to have fished with Captain Jimmy and his crew here in Guatemala numerous times. We've caught and released hundreds of sailfish together and took first place in the Guatemala Billfish Invitational out of Pacific Fins. I always do a once-over on the leaders, the reels, crimps, drags, and overall situation on the way out. It's in my DNA, always checking and rechecking. The bait of choice here is a chin-weighted swimming ballyhoo. The bite's so good out of Pacific fins that the crew has to bring hundreds of ballyhoo out each day. How far are we gonna run today? Uh, we start to fish like a 15 miles. I wanna try a little more salt. Well, uh, this time, selfish come there. So hopefully we'll get some bites today. Good luck, man. Let's do this. Woo. <laughs> so what's gonna happen here is we got these teasers out, these squid chains, and the fish come up and they try to eat these squid chains. So as soon as they come up to eat that, we try to switch out with a bait. So he'll, he'll yell right short teaser, left short teaser, because we got two on the right, two on the left. So if we get one that pops up on the short, he'll say right short teaser. So what you do is you snap this out, take the rod, bring it down to the side, and try to get the fish to bite your... Left long, left long. Left long. Left long. There he comes right here, look, he's right in the spread. Right on the teaser. Got him on. Coming up, Joe. Well, that was quick, guys. So that's how they do it in Guatemala, huh? Very fast. <laughs> Not bad, right? We got a bleeder. All right, now we pin them in the corner. How fast can we get them? This is when we have fun, right? We got our first mahi-mahi. This one's gonna be ceviche. It's gonna be on the grill. And that's how you do it in Guatemala. We've been fishing uh, three minutes. That was quick. I got my white shirt dirty. I guess that's how it's gonna start. That's how it's gonna begin. Man, this guy's just steaming. Hungry little bugger. Look at him. Dorsal fin up, tail out of the water. It's not that big. It's big enough though. 15, 20 pounder. Mahis grow very quickly and have a limited list of predators, allowing them to get very big very quickly. They can gain four to five pounds per month. So in one year, they can go from five pounds to 50 pounds. All right, you want to gaff them? That's a good one. That's a good one. That's a winner. They grow them big here in Guatemala. Look at that. Perfect fit. With a few mahi in the box, we decided to head further out to look for sailfish in an area where Captain Jimmy expects them to be. Sailfishing is my specialty. I've caught and released over 3,000 in the past 30 years, and it never gets old. Every single one is different and exciting to me, even after having caught my first one over 40 years ago. Sailfish are the fastest fish in the ocean, being clocked at 72 miles per hour. Changing directions instantly and tail walking, ripping up the water, they spent half the fight in the air. How could you not love that? We're catching fish in Guatemala, guys. Coming up jumping. Still jumping, still jumping. Okay, now I got a belly of line I gotta take up. All right. Came up on the left short teaser. 
and just kind of, you know, put the ballyhoo right there. Came up and ate it perfectly, went away perfectly. There's nothing cooler than a sailfish coming up, trying to get that teaser, trying to get that bait, and they're wiggling, their bills are going, they're swimming, they're paddling with their tails, their dorsal's flopping. They come up and eat that bait, man. It's spectacular. And every now and then, a squirrel gets a nut. And that's what happened with me just now. So right now, we're backing up. The key is to keep pressure on it. Jimmy, this fish is giving me a little bit of a hard time. Now he's coming up. Here he comes, here it comes. That's a nice sized fish, huh? Yeah! And now you take that line up fast, the captain closes the gap. Jimmy does this all day, every day. And there it is. We've got a Guatemala sailfish. Big fish. Even after getting the leader in the tip of the rod, making it a legal catch, this sail still had some energy left in the tank and wanted to show it off. So basically, when you come down to Guatemala, you can expect this. You got a professional crew, you got sailfish biting all day. That's what I'm talking about. Yeah. That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> Good job, Jimmy. Good job. Look at the size of that thing. All right, you want to come get this leader? Come on in. Nice fish. Look at that size of that fish. All right. Going away. There it is. Good job, man. Good job. Where are you, Jimmy? There you are. Look at my camera. <laughs> man, we're just getting started now. We got one. Everything prior to this moment was the calm before the storm. He's gonna come up jumping up the middle. Double up, Cap. Hooked up, double header. That's how you do it. Here's my sailfish right here, it's close. Oh, that's yours there, huh? Come on, baby. Should come up off this corner by the ship. We got a wagger, folks. Nice job, nice job, nice job. Woo. Give me some skin, bro. Woo. <laughs> as much as we enjoy the fight, we try to release them as quickly as possible and get the next spread of baits out as fast as we can, and we're back in the action. There he is. Going wild. Once you get in them, man, you can count on catching them all day long. Hey, good job today, guys. That was a good day, man. Thank you. And this guy here, El Capitan. Me too. <laughs> hey, how are you doing? After a banner day of fishing, as you're cruising back to port, it's just such a rewarding feeling, especially knowing that you and your crew will have fresh fish for dinner. That's what it's all about. I can't believe how early we're back. I thought we were like 50 miles away. We caught a couple. Thank you, Jimmy. Good job today. See you tomorrow. <laughs>